Hi, teachers. I wanted to make a quick video to show you how you can share your virtual word wall or your, even your Bitmoji classroom to your students without them being able to edit it. You can use it then as a tool to deliver notes or in this case, math vocabulary. So let me show you how to do that. It's really easy. If you're in Google Slides and you have something that you'd like to share with your students that you don't want them to edit, what you can do is go over to File, Share, Make sure that it says anyone with the link can be a viewer and push done. Before we share that link, we're gonna just put it into Word here. I'm gonna paste it in. And you see this edit USP sharing. You want to change that to present. Now when I copy and paste it, now we can see the same word wall, but there's no way to edit it. So if I click on angles and let me move myself over here and I go back to class, metric measurements, I go back to class and so forth. Students can't edit this. Now, let me go back into the teacher's one. I'm back to, um, let's go to this measurements one here. And if I added measurements and I wanted to make it bold, um, I wanted to make it bigger and centered or, or whatever it is, and you wanted to add some notes, you can add another images here that you can link uh, so students can click on it and, and, and go somewhere else, maybe to a video or, or something like that. Now, when you go back to the one that you had shared with students, if we refresh it, when we click on the measurement one, this is what you had just typed in. If I go back here, measurements, let's say, I'm just gonna do something here, um, capacity, length, time, weight, and I go back to the students and I refresh, they'll see what you, if I could spell capacity, capacity, um, you can see that now the students can see what you typed in, or if you wanted to add an image, you can hyperlink it. So let me do that. Um, let me do insert image and I can do um, search the web. Let's say a milk carton and say I wanted to grab this milk right here. I just drag it in, resize it like this. I can say click the milk and I can find a video about measuring. Okay, gallon man. Hello, uh, today's video, we're still on measurement, okay? This is the gallon man, okay. gallon man. So that looks cool. I mean, I would wanna watch the whole video, but I can click on the, the milk con container here, go up and put a link, paste the link in here and apply. So now when the student sees their side, refresh, if you tell them to click the milk, they click the milk, and they go right to that video about gallon man. Hello, uh, today's video, we're still on measurement, okay? This is the gallon man. So there's so much you can do with these word walls or with your Bitmoji classroom that you can build on it. You can add things to kind of build out to really work for your students and what they need. I hope this was helpful and um, thanks for watching.